What's up, everybody? We back with another message, another video. Thank you to all my new subscribers and future new subscribers. You know we do nothing here without God because everything is spiritually led by God over here. We cover the world from a spiritual and physical aspect to get the raw, real, and uncut answers. So anything you hear, anything you see in these end times, may you test the spirits, a.k.a. take the words and visuals back to prayer with God, as there are many Decepticons running around in these end times sent from the enemy, had a strong, close, and personal relationship with God. Good, great, and awesome. All right, everybody, March 24th, 2024, word on a good old Sunday. Couple of dreams here. So let's jump into them. The first one I had was regarding the red heifer. I saw the red heifer at least three times in this series of dreams. And each time it will walk past me and turn around and look at me. Now, here's the deal. That second time it walked past me, it was in the backyard and turned around and looked at me. And I said, okay, Lord, all right. I know that the red heifer is biblical and the word and the sacrificing of the red heifer and just a lot of symbolism and, you know, scripture with that. But the Lord basically said to me this today. He said, it will be sacrificed. And he says, the time is running out. He just said that the time is running out. It will be sacrificed. So that was huge. I said, oh, my goodness. OK, that's the first time I've ever seen this. So the Lord has just been throwing stuff. Now, then the second part of the dream I had, I saw foxes at a wedding trying to terrorize and run everything down like they were ruining everything, chasing people. And it was just so stupid. <laughs> they was making me mad in the dream. But the enemy is trying to cause chaos but his attempts are weak because the wedding was still going on and everything worked out. And if you know the wedding symbolism, Jesus coming for his bride and celebration and so forth, the enemy is not gonna be able to stop it, but he's trying to cause chaos. Thank you, Father, he just gave that to me. He's trying to cause chaos. Trying to cause chaos as usual. The fox trying to do everything it ain't supposed to be doing in your space. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> and then this last part of the dream, I was underground uh, subway train. But this train wasn't fully a train. It was like in the front, it was part creature. I saw the face of a creature, legs of a creature. And then in the back, it was an eye. And I was very uneasy. I did not get on that joker. Um, I'm like, no thanks. I felt very uneasy. But monitoring spirits to eye witchcraft you know deception making something appear to be something it's not do not get on the wrong trains in this season witchcraft can be you know manipulation it can be presented as manipulation so don't take the wrong trains in this hour watch what you're doing watch what you're looking at that's been a common theme the lord has been putting out but that red heifer thing Oh, that one shook me. I said, man, that's what time it is, huh? One last run. One last run is what the Lord has given. Make sure you're getting yourself together. Get your heart postures right. Listen to the Lord when he's telling you to do something. Please do it. Because you never know when the cutoff time is for things, okay? All right, peace and blessings, and I will catch y'all in the next one.